Plant-based ba to? Plant based ba to? Mm. Baka naman hindi. Plant based. <laughs> I've been really excited to try Burger King's newly launched plant based Whopper. But I wanted to take it further and compare this to other veggie patty burgers that the competition has to offer. And so we have it. This will be Burger King versus Shakey's versus crowd favorite Sweet Ecstasy. Who comes out on top? Let's find out. Hey guys, today we're having a picnic here in my car. How do you like it? I like it. It's <laughs> much adventure we've had since <laughs> quarantine. Apparently, there's a whole craze surrounding Burger King's plant-based burger right now. So I had to go through three different uh, Burger King branches. Mm -hmm. So here in my car right now, we're gonna be tasting three different plant-based burgers. One from Burger King, the second from Shakey's, and the third from Sweet Ecstasy. So we're gonna say no to lechon <laughs> and chicharron and all that. Well, maybe just for today. Actually, I want to try Shakey's first because Shakey's is a non-burger uh, place that actually they came out with this first before Burger King. Well, like maybe before? two weeks. Well, uh, so just, just recently, recently as well. Yeah. Right. Okay, so... Shakey's comes in a nice box. Okay, how does it look? The bun, I don't like the bun too much. It's kind of pale. The bun seems cantini. Yeah. <laughs> no offense. Cafeteria ish. Yeah. No, no offense, offense to cafeteria Shakey's. Food. This is 185 pesos. With the look of the burger, it looks pretty decent. I don't know. Hmm. Looks pretty burger like. Okay, I'll take the first bite. Okay. First impressions, alright. No, I'll wait so for you. It tastes like beef. <laughs> no strong whiff of the beef. Mm -hmm. No, no, no. Like when you eat it, sometimes you can have plant based, but not. Hmm. Bakana man hindi. Plant based. <laughs> well, that's a good thing, maybe. My thoughts. Um. In theme with what we mentioned earlier about, you know, like cafeteria canteen burger yeah, that you might have in school. Like yeah, I mean, because it has cucumber, um, raw onions. If you're used to that type of burger that maybe you serve mga catering, catering, mga ganyan, it's not too far from that. It reminds me of a sandwich. Yeah. Like a BLT. So the patty for me, maybe because we, we have so much fillers for our local patty, so doesn't taste any different. So in a way that's a good thing. But like when you have when you take a bite mm. of it, like because it's not a strong beef flavor. Mm. So it tastes like um, it's kind of overpowered by the by by the mayonnaise. That's right. That's right. By the Cucumber. The cucumber is very strong, the pickle, so... Yeah, so... Let me try again. I tasted it without the bun. Yeah, let's try it. Let's try it just this. It's very, very mild, yeah. right? Mild beef flavor. Very, very mild. Very neutral. Mm. But we're meat eaters, so, yeah. so... If you're used to eating vegetables and you had a taste of this, probably it's pretty good. Okay, so let's move on to yep. the much-hyped plant-based Burger King. Actually, I had to line up and drive through for about 30 minutes. I have this. high expectations for that because Burger King is very famous for their flame grilled patties, right? Yep. So it's it should, not focusing. It should taste smoky at least. <laughs> oh, Mark. <laughs> so it has nice grill marks. It still uh, looks like an artificial patty though. Which yep. is alright. Has lettuce, pickles, onions, tomatoes, no cheese for this one. As you can see, so it's very. It, it definitely does not look like beef. That's right. I like the smell. flame grilled smell. Can I smell it? Okay. <laughs> Should. By the way, this one came at as 175, um, not as a meal. 
so just a solo burger. And this is the Whopper sized version. Um, I understand it was supposed to come in a plant-based wrapper, but it didn't. I think they were out because there's apparently a craze. Right? right off the bat, it's sweet. <laughs> it has a hint of sweetness, like a glaze or marinade. It reminds me of something like a caramelized longanisa or chorizo, mm -hmm. Filipino chorizo gets me. We love our chorizo. <laughs> we describe everything as chorizo. No, but it's true. <laughs> Do you know what I'm saying? Like sausage. Yep, that's a good way to put it. Right. Like a chori yeah, burger, I mean. like a boracay yeah, chori burger. Exactly. Oh my god. <laughs> yes, yes, that's what I what I mean. So this plant-based burger from Burger King tastes like chori burger. <laughs> boracay in, a, in an instant. It's smoky, it's sweet. Easily between the two, I like this. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. And this comes at a Whopper Junior variant also at 75 pesos or some 79 pesos so that's a good uh, the good comparison. I like it better already because with the shaky one mm -hmm. it had all the fillings and yeah. trimmings it highlighted the plant-based patty which you can taste. All right so I'm excited we're gonna move on to the big boy the sweet X plant-based burger. This one is 500 pesos, so it, it's kind of heavy. pricey, really heavy pricey. Heavy also with the size. The yeah. famous X. It's, it's heavy. Heavy. Yeah. Mm. I'm, I don't know the bun they use here because they usually use potato bun. Um, this one also has cheese. I'm not sure what cheese they use, so we're gonna have to look that up after this. Uh, we're gonna have to make sure if it's actually vegan or if it's. Um, if it's just vegetarian. Vegan. Uh, X. Marks, marks the spot. Marks the spot. Sweet ecstasy. I'll yep. taste it first. Again. <laughs> like the first time we tried it was in Kubao X. Okay, so <laughs> you don't like it. <laughs> She's not happy. <laughs> Out of the three, this is the most plant-based flavor that you can really taste. Yeah. Do, you, do you get what I mean? Yeah. It's very planty, it's very big. Maybe that's a no. Maybe that's Beyond Burger. Beyond me. The sauce of Sweet Ecstasy, that parang Thousand Island type of dressing that they have but in all their burgers, I think, it's a bit overpowering. Yeah. So yeah. Wait, let's rate the burgers. Mm -hmm. The three burgers. So the first one, Shakey's, what's your rating? I'll give it a six. Yeah, same, same, same with same. you. So a six, we agree on that. First time that we did. <laughs> For the Whopper, maybe I'll, I'll an eight. I'll give it an eight yep, as well. An eight. Wow. <laughs> and the Sweet X Burger, just on taste alone, we're judging it. Uh, it's a seven. Same. So you, we still, you still like this better than Shakey's? Yeah, of course. Okay, okay. I mean, because like I said, the Shakey's Burger tasted like a salad. Mm -hmm. Because of the dressing, the cucumber, the lettuce, the tomatoes. Mm. This one might get better if you just start appreciating the, the nibbles of of beef beef that you taste. I think you have to give it a while. Mm. Um, I think if you are re a real vegetarian, if you're a real vegan who doesn't eat meat regularly anymore, I think that's probably a good you know taste. Although I'm still not going back on my rating yeah. because it really tastes like like not meat. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, after a while, it has this strong aftertaste, let's say. Yeah. Of like, can I even call it hempy? Hemp? Like. <laughs> I like the cheese with it. Mm. You're a vegetarian and you've been craving good burger. This is good. Decent, right? Mm. Yeah, pretty good. Yeah, pretty good. So anyway, so Janessa has requested that I eat the rest of this in the Shakey's burger and she gets to keep the popper. It's my winner. But I need to have one more bite of that. Okay. <laughs> you already ate so much of it. Oh. <laughs> anyway. I drove through the entire Manila for that. Anyway, 
Okay, so let's dig in. Yeah, You're so messy when you eat. Confirm. But this is a better burger. It's worth the hype. See? Yeah. You agree? Yep. It's very simple as well. Until you're back to Boracay. Anyway, thanks again for watching, guys. If you've liked this video, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Like this video, hit the notification bell. We have a few food reviews and tastings now. And I think we're gonna continue going if you like this. Thanks again guys, see you again next time.